Somali Cat The Somali is a long-haired Abyssinian cat with a beautiful ticked coat and a long plumed tail. They have the same personality as the Abyssinian and originates from Abyssinian breeding programs where occasionally a litter of Abyssinians would have a long-haired cat. It is not known how long the long-haired gene ended up in the Abyssinian gene pool. The gene responsible for long hair in the cat is recessive, and the cat needs two copies of the gene to have long hair. A cat can have short hair, but carry the recessive gene for long hair. The Somali has a similar shape to the Abyssinian, with a medium body and well-muscled with slim legs. Small oval feet, a broad head, and almond-shaped eyes with low-set ears. The Somali has a medium-length, soft and silky coat, medium length that can take up to two years to fully develop. There was a large ruff around the neck and a thick plumed tail, earning the breed the nickname Foxcat. All Somalis have ticked coats, which means that each hair has a base color that is interrupted by two or three brands of a darker pigment. The tip of the hair is always dark. The cat colors include red, blue, fawn, and silver. As abbeys were exported to new regions such as North America, New Zealand, and Australia, some of the descending litters began producing long-haired versions. At first, many people viewed these long-haired variants as undesirable, but thankfully others appreciated these beautiful cats. Although their name may suggest that they are from Somalia, this name was instead given to these cats because the country of Somalia borders what was once Abyssinia, which is now Ethiopia, just as Somali borders on being an Abyssinian. The Somali cat personality is a fan favorite. These kitties love being around people. They are playful, and they maintain some of their kitten tendencies into adulthood. These cats can be an excellent choice for singles or families. They can get along well with children who know how to interact correctly with animals, be sure to supervise all interactions with your Somali as they interact with children, especially those of a younger age. These friendly felines often enjoy the company of another pet in the household as well. Somali prefer not to be left alone for extended periods, so if you have a demanding job or a busy schedule, you may want to consider adopting another cat, possibly even another Somali. If you want a cat that lounges around with you all day, or one that will nap and entertain themselves, then a Somali is not the right cat for you. These cats are energetic, playful, and humorous. They prefer to be on the move, nosing around, and seeing what's going on inside the house. Just be aware that this breed also has mischievous tendencies. They may try to open cupboards or doors, and it's not unusual to hear them up to something in the wee hours of the night. All that said, Somali are still an incredibly affectionate and friendly breed. They adore their people and may even join you on the couch every once in a while, but they probably won't want to curl up in your lap. However, don't forget to consider these normal personalities with a grain of salt. Every cat is unique and has their individual personality. Some people wonder if Somali cats are hypoallergenic. Unfortunately, they are not. The average lifespan for this breed is 10 to 15 years. Although this is the expected lifespan, several factors can affect a cat's longevity. Some fun facts about the Somali cat that not everyone may know. Some cats can come in a variety of 28 colors. These cats are slow to grow and mature, and they won't typically reach full maturity until about 18 months of age.